<laughs> Darren, what's the meaning of this nonsense? I thought we understood ourselves. Why are you going out with my woman without my consent? Darren! Don't tell on me, Daddy. Don't tell on me. What's the meaning of all these things? Huh? How else do you want me to explain to you that this woman right here is mine and not yours? Stop this nonsense, Darren. Baby, baby, I'm sorry. Who's beating me? Okay. I'm sorry. Okay, sorry. All right? I just want this old man here to understand that you are mine and not his. Darren, this is my fiance. Get that into your thick skull. Do you understand me? What's all this, Daddy? Huh? Tell me. Why are you so comfortable being intimate with someone that I was intimate with before? Huh? Like it baffles my mind, baby. See, baby. Are you, are you, are you, are you stupid? Are you stupid? Is there something wrong with your head? Now beat me. Beat me. Yes. Just beat your father. Go ahead and beat your father. Are you sick? Try this once more. I will forget that you are my son. And I will deal with you accordingly. Teaching you there, son. I am glad you are finding your feet there. Mm, that's good. Oh, I'm strong, I'm strong, I'm fit. I mean, <laughs> your dad is as fit as fiddle. I can still kick a 40 yard penalty. <laughs> um, so, the car is ready. Uh, son, I've got to run. Ah, my driver is here. Hmm? Okay, so let's talk later. Keep doing what you're supposed to do, okay? All right, son. Love you too, son. Bye now. Okay. I'm tired of this. Why am I so unlucky? You're not unlucky, Pearl. Don't say that again. So how do you explain this? How do you explain me being hurt by every single guy I've been with? All of them. I thought Alex was different. 
I mean, I thought I had found my person, the person that was going to love me right. But again, I was wrong. I've just wasted another year of my life. Maybe I'm the problem. Maybe I was, I was struck with bad luck. Do you know, Alex brought that girl into my own house. They sat on this couch here. Don't say that again about yourself. For what? Those guys? They don't deserve you. You are the sweetest person I have ever known. You deserve better. Maybe I'm not meant to get married. Not every woman gets married. I mean, you see women, older women, and they're not married. Maybe, maybe that's what I'm destined for, and it's not a bad thing, I guess. You know what? Enough of all this. Enough of all this, guys. You're going to get up. You need to get with that. Get up, let's go. Get busy. Let's go do something. Share up. You just have to be happy. Don't do this to yourself. Because of what? Do what? Come, let's go. Let's just do something fun. <sighs> Thank you, baby. You're the best. <laughs> you are my best. Do you like it? Let me check. This is everything. <laughs> I love it. You've shown how to impress me. Well, I'm glad you like it. And you know how much I love taking care of my man. That's why I love you. You know you always got me covered on that part. And I will love you more every day. I love you too. And I pack takeout for you. I know you always want it. Hmm. Thank you, baby. Thank you for loving me. You know what? Stop. Sorry, I can't. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Thank you. Love you. Donald, Thank you. I. The meaning of this rubbish. What are you doing here? What am I doing here? Is that the kind of stupid question you're meant to be asking me? Who is this? And what is she doing here? Who is she? She's just a random girl who's obsessed with me. You know what? Everything is wrong. Get it? I am the man here. You don't question my movement. So you don't ask me where I go to or how I come back. Don't ask me those questions. Just calm down. It was just a simple question. It doesn't require your shouting. Oh my God. Oh my God. Just a question, right? Get it in your tick skull. All you are is beauty without brains. What you have up here is just an empty head. I'll be managing you. Trust me, I'll be managing this beauty with our brains. Every opportunity you get to talk down on me and hurt me, you do it. Why? Oh, you just a beauty with our brains. And you know what? This is what I've been dealing with. And I can't continue to manage this anymore. Hey. You are nothing but beauty with our brains. And you know what? You are so foolish. And to imagine that you are with a guy like me, a guy with value like me, and you don't even appreciate it. I don't know what to call it. As much of fact, you are nothing without me, and you should get that in your in, in your empty skull, okay? Whenever you think about me, think about us, always realize that I am helping you. Hey. 
And where do you think you're going? If you step out of that door, don't ever come back here. Don't ever. And I mean it. Damn. So, for you, or is that? Sometimes I just actually lack words to express myself. You know, you're more like the only sun that shines in my life. You give me a whole lot of hope. You make me feel complete. And every moment feels so new that it means the whole world to me. Sometimes I think that you're my angel sent by God to me here on earth. Oh, okay. <laughs> oh. I love you, baby. From the depth of my heart, I really do love you. And I'll continue to love you till my love wears out. Be careful what you promise. I know exactly what I promise. And then. I equally know what I've always wanted. And believe me, you are even more than what I ever imagined. I can't love you less. I love you, my girl. And I always love you. How do I always end up being alone? After so much effort in my relationships, why does the same thing keep happening to me over and over again? Why? I'm so stupid. Maybe I'm not meant to be with anyone. Maybe I'm meant to die alone. Maybe I'm just... <sighs> so many questions and no answers. God, I'm so tired. 
worthless. And I have missed you too. <laughs> I'm so sorry. I didn't mean to bolt at the time I knew it was your worst. Stop. <laughs> I'm not mad, really. I know how important this training was to you. It was, I mean, you've been waiting on it for a very long time. So, enough about that. Tell me, how was the training? Thank you so much. How have you been? I was worried sick about you while I was in training. I've been fine, really. I can't say otherwise. <laughs> I'm sorry about Alex. He didn't deserve you. Now, I want you to stop wearing this face. <laughs> You're too pretty to let things like that bother you. More like pretty face, bad luck. God forbid. <laughs> you don't have bad luck. <laughs> I think maybe it's a thing with age. You know, I feel like... The younger these guys are, the less their priorities are intact, the less focus they have, the more frolicking they do. I don't know, I'm not sure. That's not true. I think you've not met the right guy. Trust me, there are a lot of good men out there. Either ways, I'm done, okay? I am done taking their rubbish. I'm just going to focus on myself now. That's what matters to me. <laughs> and enough about men and me. Tell me, how was training? Okay. Training was fun. Mm -hmm. I had a lot to learn. Mm -hmm. I met a lot of new people, but trust me, none compared to you. <laughs> <laughs> you told me, you, you mentioned something about your supervisor. My supervisor, he was trouble. He literally wanted my life. Feels like the devil always sends somebody. <laughs> 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 of course. I was, I was doing everything possible to impress this man, but it seems like I wasn't doing enough. At the yeah. end of the day, you pass the training. That's what matters. Yeah, that's what matters. Come here. <laughs> <laughs> Yes. Y yes, we've sent out your package, Ma. Okay. Thank you for your patronage. All right. Bye-bye. <sighs> Hello, Pearl Enterprises. How can I help you? Yes. Oh, no, sir. That was a complimentary gift from the company. Okay. Oh, you'd like to order more. Can I take down your order? Okay. 20 cents of candles. All right. I'm... Rose petal flowers. Yes, great choice. How about the cinnamon? It, I promise you, it has a fantastic scent. <laughs> okay. Okay, we'll, we'll throw in five. Okay. All right, so um, the account details is on the bio on my Instagram page, or if you want, I can send it directly to you. Once you make payments, just send us a receipt for confirmation. Okay. Well, thank you for your patronage. All right, bye-bye. cross-check the products before you send them out, okay? All right, thank you.
Madam, <sighs> you kept me waiting. Uh -uh. Why did you use the spare key now? I gave you one. I forgot it. Sorry. Since you told me you were already on your way, Sorry. I thought you'd be home. I had so many orders to meet up with today. You know, I just resumed work three days ago. I had to go to the warehouse and look at the new products, make sure they are good, the quality is fair. So I've just been doing a lot, sorry. <laughs> I'm so happy you're getting back to yourself. Honestly, I'm so happy. <laughs> I couldn't have gotten here without you, so thank you. Mm. You don't have to thank me. What are friends for? You would do the same for me, right? Mm. Oh, babe, you know what? I'm so hungry. Let's get something to eat. Mind you, we are going shopping tomorrow. Shopping for what? I just started work. To celebrate, of course. To celebrate, <laughs> to celebrate what? To celebrate what you just told me. You've started going to work, so we need to celebrate. <laughs> hey, any opportunity to shop. Uh -huh. And I think we should cook today. It's not every day we are going out to eat. What do you know how to cook so that you can enter the kitchen and cook it? Babe, I'm tired. I just got here. You know, I've been waiting outside since under the sun. Oh, so that's why you cannot cook? Because you've been waiting under the sun? I mean, this is your house, so you should cook for me. Mm -hmm. Will you eat dodo? <laughs> Bless all that, please. I'm hungry. Here is my poor. <sighs> Come, I'm seeing some things that look nice here. Ooh, look at this one. Red dress. Check this one. Although it's like wine. I think it's a two piece. No, I need to prepare red. Which one? Ooh, look at this shoe. This is so I love it. Oh, that's a beautiful dress. The heel is this, the heel is actually too long. <laughs> Thank you. Is it for your daughter? Uh, no, for my niece. Oh, how old is she turning? Yeah, twenty. Uh, you know, I want to get a birthday gift for her, surprise gift. Well, if she's turning 20, that's not her style. Oh, really? Yeah, really. What, what would I choose then? Um, let's see. Usually, they like to do a mini skirt. Oh, really? <laughs> or maybe like a... Like a dress that has a color that will pop. So, this. Okay. With maybe pink shoes to match, or ooh, I love these shoes. I love this as well. Oh, oh, oh. so this is like a perfect combination. Oh, oh, great! I, I'm, I'm actually grateful. You're a lady, so you know these things. I, I just wanted to surprise her. I don't, I don't really have much ideas about these things, you know. Uh, you know. Uh, uh, thank you. So I get them for her. Sure. Mm, I get them for her. Yeah. Thank you. Sorry. I don't mean to offend, but maybe shouldn't your wife be helping you with this? Oh, uh, she's passed. Oh, I, I'm so sorry. Oh, it's okay. I, I mean, it's been long ago. Life must go on. Just keep moving. But I'm actually grateful for this. Oh, you know, you're assisting me. Oh, um, by the way, uh, uh, that's your friend, I suppose? Yeah, that's my friend. I didn't get to ask your name. I'm Pearl, and that's my friend for me. Oh, it's a pleasure. Oh, <laughs> it's a pleasure. Thank you, sir. And I am Charles. Nice to meet you, Charles. It's it's wonderful. I suppose you came shopping. Yes. Uh, yes are you we done? Did. No, no, we just started. Oh, why don't I uh, look around while you shop, and then we could meet at the paperwork. All right. Thank you, sir. Great. Thank you so much. <clears throat> um, come and help me arrange this. Uh, I think I. Oh, well. Uh, I really don't, don't have anything for myself here. <laughs> oh, I think I like this. Uh, oh, really? Uh, this is nice. So, but... Okay, uh, ladies, are you done? Yes. Um, well, 
while she's trying to check. Uh, ah, but that's quite a lot. Just don't worry, don't worry. I'll assist you. It's Sorry. okay. It's fine, it's fine, it's fine. Um, yeah, that's um, um, oh, um, okay, ladies, you know what we will do now? Uh, she will check what these would cost. Yes. And then, um, you wouldn't bother your beautiful heads at all. I will settle it. Oh, okay. Thank you, sir. I'd like to appreciate you for what you've done for me. Please, this is my card. Um, I'd like you to call me when you have a little time. Uh, I would uh, want to appreciate you better. Okay? All right. Um, uh, Monday? Monday, come in now. Okay, sir. Anyway, that's all. Okay. Um, the young lady will check and then you transfer the Okay? okay. And the ladies will remain in the car and collect all this and we'll take them home. Right, so ladies, after you. Thank you, sir. Thank you so much, sir. After Okay, Monday. <laughs> oh my gosh. What was that? <laughs> I can't believe he paid for everything. <laughs> Honestly. Oh my gosh. Do you know how much we would have spent if we bought this with our Of own course, money? he just saved us a huge amount of money. Hey. Hey. We forgot to stop at the restaurant to get food though. So, we are supposed to go to the restaurant but I was so happy and I forgot. Huh? <laughs> it's fine. Let's just order jollof rice. Jollof rice? No, I want to order pizza. I, I thought we say we are cutting down our calories now. Calories? And you want to eat jollof? <laughs> What's the difference? <laughs> <laughs> I bet you order pizza. Should I order for you? Mm. Hmm? Mm. <laughs> Been searching for a love that's pure, a heart so sure. All my life, I've been searching for a love like ours forevermore. And I found you in the nick of time, yeah. When hope was fading, love was hard to find. serious what were you expecting it's just a normal thank you brunch that's it two times brunch hell what? that one can't be that grateful but just a picked gift so what are you trying to say nothing just wondering his intentions he's a widow after all so anything is possible uh -uh. For me, this is your spot, man, you put in drug glue. <laughs> I mean, if he's a widow, so what? Me, am I a widow? Well, I did not say that, though. <laughs> <laughs> Babes, honestly, I'm just trying to point out the truth to you. Please stop acting as if you're not seeing the light. What? What light? Is it the, the yellow one or the white one? You're a fool. <laughs> <laughs> it, it, it's not your fault. <laughs> but I'm serious. What? Hello? Yes, I'm fine. 
another brunch? Oh, no, 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 not a brunch this time. A proper date. <sighs> well, uh, <laughs> a date, really. gathering intelligent people. Well, let's see. I do. Will you let me know you? A date it is. But I must warn you, there is nothing to know about me. <laughs> Just so you're not disappointed. Yes, I own a brand. I create branded scented candles and some other interior accessories. Amazing. Amazing. <laughs> Thank Smart. you. Smart. That's great. And yourself, what do you do? Um, well, I import raw materials for companies and export spices to other countries. Some contracts here and there, you know, you can hustle a bit. <laughs> Exporting spices, that sounds brilliant. <laughs> oh, well, thank you. Um, I also um, succeeded in that. You know, um, well, uh, my wife passed eight years ago and left me a brilliant son. Uh, so proud of him. He's in Europe taking care of business for us. You must be so proud of him. Oh, absolutely. I am proud of him. He's and doing I'm, quite well. I'm sorry about your wife. Well, that's gone some time ago. Sometimes he gets lonely, though. Well, shake off the sadness. I think um, at some point in everyone's life, they get lonely, but it's important to find the happiness even in those moments. You're so intelligent. Okay, enough about me. Let's talk about you now. Um, are you dating someone? Oh, I am. Um, I haven't had much luck with uh, relationships, so I'm focusing on myself right now. Focusing on yourself, focusing on yourself. Well, it's good to focus on one several times. But, Bill, I like you a lot. I would want to be part of your life if you let me. What? <laughs> you cannot tell me. Um, it's it's actually it's actually good for your color. 
Uh, you know, you're as bright as the sun. So this guy good. <laughs> <laughs> so, so, so let's get that. But oh, by the way, you have a red dress, you know. It's beautiful. Like red wine, right? <laughs> <laughs> okay, well, I, I think that's good. Um, do you yeah. need another thing? Oh, well, why don't we pay for this? Okay. All right, great. Great. Um, uh, Monday? Monday? Yes, sir. Um, Monday? Yes, sir. Um, just take care of it, right? We'll be in the car. All right, sir. Okay. How is it? I love it. This your training really did you some good. It has improved. The only thing is, I would prefer it shorter. Oh, you're not serious. You see, your girl is now a pro. So bring in your materials. I'm ready. I will. Yeah, so just me. Just you what? Mm -hmm. You and Mr. Charles have been going out a lot lately. So don't just tell me just another date. <laughs> okay, fine, fine. He asked me out. And you said what? I don't know. I'm still thinking about it. You're still thinking about it? Mm-hmm. Babe, you should consider it already. I mean, he has good intentions. I mean, I guess it, it may not be so bad dating someone older. Right? Now you're talking. And you know, despite his age, he still looks good. He's wealthy and single, so you don't need to miss out on this chance. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> so, if you don't do it for love, mm -hmm. the money should motivate you. <laughs> <laughs> you sound like a gold digger. <laughs> I'm serious. Now, speaking of materials, I have two Ankara materials and mm -hmm. I want mini skirts. I can't hear you. What mini did you, skirts. What did you say? And then those tops that are like corsets. <laughs> I can't hear you. Come, come, Samson. Um, well, he's um, he's my boy. Um, welcome to my very poor home. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Make yourself comfortable. Um, we will prepare a sumptuous meal to welcome into my home. What are you going to prepare? You've not been here before, so I will prepare something that will be very memorable. <laughs> this is memorable enough. I um, I love these pieces. They're very well thought out. <sighs> they are uh, my collection, so they actually represent what I love, um, but enough of my house and my artwork. Come here. <laughs> Sit. Let's talk about you. What about me? When you walk along the road, do cars bump into each other because of how beautiful you are? <laughs> <laughs> okay, I was <I'm> joking. <laughs> I thought as much. Um, let's talk about love. What do you think about love? Well, mm. I think love is the icing on a giant cake. You know, it can be beautiful and sweet, but it can also be cruel. I think the number one misconception is that people think love is an emotion. But really, it's a commitment. I tell you, this is the smartest thing I've heard in recent times. I, I have fallen deeply in love with you. You are beautiful. And you make me feel at peace. You make me happy. Yes. Uh, Mr. Charles. Yes. If I may ask, what exactly do you want with me? I'm almost 30 and I don't know how old you are exactly, but you're at least 
double my age. So I was wondering. Does this answer your question? Yes. You are beautiful. You are elegant. You are smart. You give me peace. You are everything I want. But you also have brains. And that is what I adore. Why did I say anything wrong, done anything wrong? No, you haven't. Thank you for saying those words to me. Oh, really? Then I'll call you a queen. <laughs> <laughs> There's something I want to tell you. Mm -hmm. And in those days, I, I used to wonder how the moon can dance. And do you know I found her? In your eyes. <laughs> I see the moon dancing. You can't spend all day flattering me. That's not what our days are for. We need to be productive. Who told you I'm not productive? Because I'm productive. I'm a <laughs> But there is nothing that will make you grow older than to admire this beautiful lady. <laughs> That's it. Let me get us something to snack on. I can't wait. <laughs> oh, you know, when you're in love with a beautiful, beautiful girl, you either become insane or you become saner than you were before. <laughs> My queen. Lovely. You know, you know the beauty of the popcorn? Because it keeps crackling. Just like your eyes. Oh. <laughs> Do you like it? Absolutely. Anything you make will make me grow younger. <laughs> <laughs> so, what should we watch? Mm. Well, kind of romance, huh? Rom com? Sure. Should we watch a recent one or something from the 90s? Mm. <laughs> this one has Sandra Bullock. Ah, Sandra! <laughs> she doesn't get old like you. She keeps getting younger. What are you getting this time? Ah, I will shock you. Don't blink, just. You know, you said that love could be cruel, it could also be beautiful. For me? Yes. Anything for you, my queen. <laughs> that is why you are my queen. And I'll do anything for you. <laughs> we are already doing too much. No. You deserve much more than this because you're a queen, my queen. <laughs> this. 
this is just the beginning. You will be shocked. <laughs> Mm. That's good news, son. Don't worry, you see how I'm going to arrive. Mm? Dad, I'm not rushing. I just want to know the special you talk about each time we talk. Ah, uh ah. -uh. Dad, why are you in a hurry? You're coming back to Nigeria soon. Do you see her? I'm in a rush. If you say so. I got my ticket last night. I can't wait to be home. I miss you so much, Daddy. Oh, great. I can't wait to see you, son. I miss you, too. I got to go, son. I got to go. All right. Uh, well, we'll talk again tomorrow. Good night. <laughs> okay, Dad. Take care of you. Bye. Ah, <laughs> Darren. Don't worry, you meet her. You see how beautiful she is, and you love you. You love her. You love her for your daddy. She's having a beauty sleep. Ashoka.
Angel. Angel. Mm. I brought you breakfast in bed. <laughs> Prepared with love from me. No, you're not. <laughs> this is as real as you can be. Now, it's all yours. Thank you. Yes, my darling. <clears throat> <sighs> you are so beautiful like the early morning sun. Smart, good, loving, caring. That's good. That's why you're pale. <laughs> oh, this looks nice. Let me try For you, my angel. <laughs> Can I have your left hand? <clears throat> well, mm -hmm. will you marry me to be my companion for life, to build a home with me, to love and to cherish? Till we die. No, of course. Yes, I'll marry you. It's <laughs> <laughs> mm. beautiful. That makes me happy because you. I breathe in you. Am I dreaming? No, it's <laughs> real. <laughs> now come here. <laughs> I'm so happy for you. I didn't know he was so serious with you. I know. The biggest shocker of my life. And it still feels like a dream. <laughs> Are you really sure about this? Moving in with him? I mean, I'm going to miss you. <laughs> I know it's just an engagement, but... Are you having cold feet on my behalf? <laughs> <laughs> Look, I know it all seems sudden, but this is what Charles and I want. And I've never been with any man who even compares to him. So why not? I thought it was just for the money. When has it ever just been for the money? <laughs> Look, he makes me feel safe and loved. And he, <laughs> he's constantly complimenting me on how smart, intelligent and beautiful I am. He honestly just makes me question how I could have been with any of those idiots from my past. I understand. And this is still my home. Mm -hmm. You have a key, so you can come anytime you want until the rent expires. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you're right. <laughs> mm. Wow, I'm so happy for you. Are you still here? Yeah. I'm just like... I can't believe I let how those men from my past treat me like that. And somehow I thought I was bad luck. Babes, I already told you that they don't deserve you. I mean, there's always someone for anyone. Okay, let's just say they were just in your life, building you up until you meet your peace of mind. <laughs> <laughs> Thank I'm you. I'm going to miss you. 
I yeah, really yeah. miss you. But stop saying it like I'm dying or something. I'm but just... I can't see you anytime I want to see you. I can't even call you anytime. What? It's just my son. I know, but it's still the same anxious feeling you get when you're about to meet your partner's family. <laughs> You're yeah, just going to be my son, not the whole community. <laughs> Stop laughing at me. What if he doesn't like me? Why wouldn't he? There is nothing in the world that would make him not like you. I've told him a lot of good things about you. Positive things. Where is my Emma? Mm, that's my son. <laughs> Welcome home, son. Thank you, Daddy. You're looking you, good. You, you really look take good. good care of yourself. <laughs> <laughs> really taking good care of yourself, sir. Oh, that's um, that's the machine that leaves my heart. <laughs> I, uh, I, uh, it makes it, you know, young. <laughs> you know what I mean? <laughs> so how are you doing? Fine. Good. Good. Uh -huh. mm. Yeah. It's good to see you. Your father has said a lot of good things about you. Good to see you too. So, we'll catch up with a lot of things, events, places, things, people, you know, at the dinner table. Yeah. So, tell them in the kitchen, you know what to do. Okay, oh, welcome, son, to your room then. What are you doing here? Huh? What are you doing here? What are you doing, my father? Wait, all of this is for revenge for what I did to you? Huh? How did you even get in touch with my family? Answer me! Answer which of your stupid questions, eh? What are you doing, my father? What does it look like? We're dating! The, what? what? Is this meant to be revenge? What kind of stupid dating are you talking about? You're so scared Karma is catching up with you, aren't you? You see, you bitch, if you... Hide! Try it and I will call the police on you. Jules, and just for your information, I am with your father because I love him. You think I have the time to waste trying to get revenge on a worthless piece of shit like you? Hey, you don't, you don't, you don't talk to me. Telling you it's okay and that you're not saying anything.
Mm. Son, I've been enjoying the meal. It was specially made for you. Yeah, it's really good. <clears throat> I miss eating good meals. Mm. I can see it. I can see it. We were attacking the chicken. Yeah. Mm. You know, this is, this is, this is done here. Yeah. Mm. Sweetheart. Yes. You sure? Yes. But you should taste good. Now, come here. Come here. Come here. Come here. <coughs> Great. <coughs> mm. Take some. <coughs> take, take care. You'll be fine. So, had another one. Mm. Great. Mm. You know, she lights up the environment. Mm. I'm glad you like her. <clears throat> you know, sweetheart, I actually made them to make this chicken so tender for you. Wow. See, I like the way you chew the things. It's quite good. <laughs> lovely, lovely. Lovely, darling. Lovely. Wow. Lovely. Son, eat, 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 eat. Eat. Mmm. house. Move out of this house. If you think you're going to be in this house to be my father's whatever, then you must be a joker. Well, I am in this house and I'm not moving out just because you want me to. Oh. You brave. It's because of my old man. Listen, I cannot let you be with my father. He cannot be with my ex. Never. Enough of this rubbish. Yeah. Excuse me. I, I will scream if you try it. Move. I said move! Rubbish. <laughs> Almost. <laughs> Daddy, this is supposed to be your show. Okay. <laughs> you still got it. You still got it. You still got it. <laughs> okay. Um, no way, no way, no way, no, no way. Uh, this is not going in. <laughs> <laughs> Let me try this. Uh, nice one. By the way, yes, you said you wanted to discuss something with me last time. I said you needed to rest. Yes, yes, Dad. Um, I just wanted to know why you why you chose that lady as your partner. Why not? She's young, so that's good. <laughs> I know, <laughs> but I just want to know if um, if maybe my father has issues with older women. Because I, 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 I feel that you should get a woman, at least maybe you're older than there, like four, five years. That's fine. I'm, I'm, I'm still here with you and I'll need someone, you know, like I need a motherly love as well. And I don't think that one can even take care of herself, talk less of taking care of me, daddy. Yeah, yeah, but, but Darren, this is not what we should be talking about now. We, let's talk about it some of the time. Don't worry about that, you know. Don't, don't think about that. I just saw them sounds. I'm sorry, Daddy. I just, I was just feeling like she won't fly as your woman, you know? Why not? With well, your swag, you know, you were moving. You need to move yeah, someone. You know. <laughs> <laughs> That's my father. Yeah, you know what I meant. Don't know why you didn't fly. No problem. That's cool. No, no so problem, play ball, man. All right, Daddy. All right, let's go. <laughs> Woo. Oh! <laughs> I'll bring it out. All right, honey. <laughs> I think it's going to come out from yeah, here. Yes, okay, okay. Jesus Christ. 
Yes. Wow. This is the most unexpected news I've heard this year. Look, I couldn't... Not in the world. I couldn't control my expression when I saw him. The world is really a small place. You know, I still can't believe this. And he's asking you to leave the house. That is my major concern. Why is that your concern? I just found out that my boyfriend is my ex's father. Why should it not be a concern? So because he's your ex. He's not your business. His father is your business, so he can bingo. I mean, it's easier said than done. Darren doesn't look like he's moving until I'm out of that house. He has no choice but to see you. Girl, you are in charge of the man of the house. So you know what? Just let the backing dog be chained. Don't let his backing make you waver. The most important thing is you love his father and he loves you too. You're right. I love Charles and he loves me too. I don't need to allow this stupid boy into friend what we're doing. Of course, that's my goal. You know what? You don't need to let him win in the past and win in the present. Power has changed hands. He has no option but to accept it. Don't let it bother you. Does he know? Does my father know that you're my ex? Yeah, it's quite obvious that you're here for his money and for revenge. Am I right? What is wrong with you? I've said it to you before. I don't have the time to waste trying to get revenge on you. Does he know? That's the question. Does he know? Yes, 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 I'm in a hurry. I'm going for a meeting. No, but please listen. Okay? You need to send that girl away. You cannot take her in as your wife. Dara, that girl you addressed that way is my fiance. Address her properly. That, that girl is young. Okay? She's possibly my age or even younger. How about that? Please, how do you expect me to address her as mother? Dara, Dara, what does age got to do with this? Age has nothing to do with this. I love that young woman. I want to marry her. That's just that. Well, Dad, I'm not going to allow that. Yes. What if she's a gold digger? What if she's just pretending to love you? Dad! No, 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 Dad. I'm just saying the truth, okay? I'm, I'm probably she's here to be, to, to, to spy on you or to blackmail you Dad, or something. enough of that nonsense. Get out of my sight now. I have a video to attend. Daddy, you better think about what I'm telling you. You better think about... What is it? What are you so afraid of? I love your father. Can you just let me be? Let you be? Yes! Over my dead body. Okay? I will not allow you to end up with my father. Not in this life or the one to come. Okay? So just go upstairs, pack your things, and leave this house! I am in this house because my fiancé, your father, wants me to be here. Now, until he says otherwise, I am not moving an inch. You're not moving an inch? No. What do you say? <laughs> Listen to me, Pearl. You are getting on my last nerve. So this is what you're going to do. You're going to go upstairs, pack your things, and leave. Because you will not like my next line of action. Now what? Do whatever you want to do. I am not leaving your father just because you don't like it. Okay? And let this be the last time we have to address this rubbish. Now I'm going to tend to my man. What, what, what do you mean I'm going to tend to your man? Eh? I'm talking to you! 
Father, I present to you Miss Felicia. She's a businesswoman. She wants a small skill enterprise. She's doing so well. Mm. Okay. Wife material. So what do I do with her? Wife material. What does that mean? Wife material, father. For who? She deserves to be your wife. Not a thing up there. You're insane, or you're drunk, or both. Number one, I don't need a wife. Number two, this lady here is so beautiful. <laughs> She's so nice. She hasn't done anything to me. Exactly. Good. Pause. Pause. Okay. Pause. So I, I actually appreciate your effort to make me happy. But my happiness doesn't depend on you. I want you to leave my house quietly. I do not want to order you because you've done nothing to me. Please, get up and leave. I don't know whether you've been entertained, but it's one of those things. Thanks for coming. Bye-bye. Sit down! Sit down. I said sit down. You sit your ass down. Ah, see this old show we are paid for. You say you be Jehovah Witness, you go preach to my father. Only oh, Ghana man go say, "Oh, yeah, it's me. Yeah, it's so me, Daddy." Daddy, 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 you are, Daddy, you are off your rocker. Daddy, Daddy, go and sleep. You lost a good woman. You lost a good woman. Oh my God, Daddy, I'm going to tell you something, Daddy. I have the best of women upstairs. Let me have some things. Really? Yes, sir. Um. I'm sorry. I'm sorry about what happened yesterday. I, I was drunk. I disrespected you. I, I just don't like the fact that you're with a younger person. Sorry, son. Whether you're young at heart, or young, old at heart, or old, it's just about the heart. Just like music, you know. When the musician is playing, you may not really understand the language. How do you understand the music? Because it's a thing of the mind. The appreciation comes from the heart. It, it's not. It's not really something that's ephemeral or physical. So I. I I understand you. But I do love her. No, I know. 
I just hope that one day, just like you accept music that's not in your language, and you love it, you will come to accept that. <laughs> I know, that ain't but this is not good for you. I know it. I feel it, Father. And girls like her just get into other people's lives to steal, to take. Daddy, and you would not know their true intentions until later. You know, Dad, you have to be right. But just like music, it's not all. But once you are able to appreciate the strumming, the sound, then you will love the music. <laughs> Dara? Dara? Mary? It's all right. We can discuss this some other time, maybe. Let me try to digest all the things that have happened, all the things you've said. Just like good music as well. You don't rush into taking decisions. You, you try to understand the philosophy behind the music, the strumming, the instruments. You try to internalize that. And that takes a little while, doesn't it? So let me process what you just said. You can go now. Thank you. Alright, son. Once again, I am I'm sorry. That's good. <laughs> Thank you, Daddy. Alright, son. It's about it's about the mind. It's about the mind. It's about majority. It comes in stages. Yes, the the shipment has been done. Um, it should be arriving in Brussels in uh, let's say seven days. Yes, yes, at the port. Yes, uh, yes. Okay, uh, let's talk later at night when. Uh, yes. Okay. Thank you. Yes. Now, mm -hmm. what happened to the Queen with the contract I sent her to do? <laughs> well, I was shocked when they said they needed 400 candles. I was like, what do you need 400 candles for? Then she said she was throwing a candle themed party. That I've been overwhelmed by it, but it's going well. See what I mean? Congratulations. <laughs> so what do I offer you for the success of this contract? Something to lift my mood. Let's start with this. Mm. Doesn't it taste like the queen? <laughs> <laughs> oh, by the way, my son, no worry, he'll come around. Mm? So once he gets to know you, he'll love you, he'll come around. He doesn't like me. Don't worry. for the queen. <laughs> <laughs> watching it. Yes. If you want to see a movie, go to your house. You don't belong here, Belle. Leave. Leave my father. Leave quietly, oh like God, to never assist him. Think, I love your father. Do you love my father? Yes. Do you love a man that is old enough to be your father? 
This old man that you speak of is giving me all of the things you never could. Oh, all the things. Things like what? His wealth? His luxury? And you spending lavishly? No. Love. Huh? Respect. Value, compassion, kindness. All the things that you never could. See, mark my words. I am going to cut your tail. Mark my words. Do your worst, Darren. Go ahead and do it. Nothing good has ever been able to come out of your rotten mouth. So get on with it, or leave me the hell you. <laughs> Let's wait and see how he's going to react after I tell him about us. now. I don't know what you have in mind, but I really do love your father. You know I'm not that kind of person. Love. You're begging me now. Listen to me. Leave this house before the end of tomorrow. And also I'll tell him about us. And I see how he's going to react. She's just using you for wealth and status. Darren, Pearl is a good lady. I love her. Why don't you allow this rest? I cannot let it rest, Daddy. No. She don't know this girl. All right? You don't know her. She's just pretending to be nice and that she loves you, but she doesn't. I, mean, I, I, I cannot allow you to end up with a girl like Darren. that. Darren. Darren. Why are you against this relationship? What exactly is the problem? Say it now. Forever keep your trap shut. Because... Because of what, Darren? Because she's my ex-girlfriend. Yes. What did you say? Dad, you heard me. She is my ex-girlfriend. Belle is my ex-girlfriend. That is why I cannot allow you be with someone like that. Please, can we talk about it? I'm sorry I didn't mention it earlier. It's just, I thought that it would affect us. Is that why you pretended not to know him? I thought we shared everything. Why did you deceive me? No, it was never my intention to deceive you. It's just... I know that it was wrong and I'm sorry. I, I had no idea that you were his father. Darren never spoke of relatives or even showed me pictures of them. 
And when I came here, I, I, I didn't see a picture of you and Darren together. You only ever spoke about him. If you didn't tell me something this important, what else would you be hiding from me? No, no. Other than Darren being my ex, there's nothing else I've hidden from you. I've told you everything. I know that I was wrong, but please, try to understand that. I knew you wouldn't like it. See, I'm very hot. I'm so distraught. I don't know how to do it or what to do. I need to process this. I need to, I need to understand what's happening, what to do. I, I just need some time to do that. Darling, please. Searching for a love that's pure, a heart so sure. All my life, I've been searching for a love like ours forevermore. And I found you in the nick of time, yeah. When hope was fading, love was hard to find.
my queen, please, 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 don't do this, please, you're hurting me, please, please, don't, 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 don't break my heart, you shouldn't do this to me, please don't leave me, please. Look, I can't stay here anymore, <sighs> have you ignore me and treat me like you did. I'm sorry, my queen, I'm sorry, I, I was hurt, uh, I didn't know I was pushing you away, I didn't tend to, please. But you were. I'm sorry. I'm come, 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 come in, come in, come in, come in, come in. Sit down. <sighs> Sit down. You don't know what you mean to me. If you leave, I'll be like fish out of water. I'll be dead. Please, don't leave me. Stop saying you'll be dead. Yeah, but. Does that mean you stay? Thank you. Now you brought back my life. Come here. Now my life again. Okay. You know what's gonna happen? I'll get you some juice. Hmm? You like it? Now relax. Um, uh, who is that? Samson, take the bag up! Take the box up! First day I wanted us to go out. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I, you know, I, you know, I had a, I had like a million things in my head going now. I imagine, I suppose she slapped me. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't look mean, did I? No, you didn't look mean, but I just um, this elderly man with this, um, you know, do you know? I was just thinking about the beauty and the beast. <laughs> That's not nice. Well, everything can be nice, can they? But I just thought, I suppose she slaps you. How are you going to take it? <laughs> you know, suppose someone was watching me play this. I was wondering, what did he do as a child? <laughs> <laughs> so, so, you know, I said I was going to sing for her. No, something like, I love you, you. Oh, you. On the first day you met me. Absolutely. No. <laughs> like no one else will ever do. <laughs> Always true, true, true. I'll forever be <laughs> to you. I love you like no one will. You know, um, I, I didn't really do literature in school in those days, you know, <laughs> but, but I read poetry. And I know that your eyes can wake a dead person. <laughs> I'm not joking. I'm serious, brother. You know, they're so beautiful, so calm, so so innovating, so energizing. That's why you're a queen. <laughs> that is. Let's drink to love, real love, love that is not emotional. Love that is functional. Love that comes from within, so it doesn't die. <laughs> <laughs> now drink. Ah, 
But I really wonder why you were created this beautiful. Have you thought about that? <laughs> no, we're Have missing you? the movie. And, well, the movie is as important as you are. <laughs> <laughs> After all, it's just a movie. But you are more than a movie. <laughs> She's actually very beautiful. Thinking about it now. Huh. That was the attraction back then. God, good sex, smiles, and she did love me. I was too possessive that I didn't even realize. Since you came into my life, I, you know, like blood transfusion, you've transfused me, so I've come alive. <laughs> <laughs> By the way, did you trim your bed this morning? Um, yes, I did this morning. Okay. Daddy. Yes, son. I, I want to speak to you. Yeah. Oh, what's the problem? Um, I can't believe that girl is still in this house after what I told you about us. That's not your problem. It didn't work out for you. It's working out for me. I love her. So, what business of yours is it? Dad. Yes? You cannot be with her. Okay, she's not good for you. No, I wouldn't allow that. So who says that? Who says she's not good for me? You? What business of yours is that? I love her. And she loves me. And that doesn't concern you, young man, does it? Dad, I am not going to let you keep sleeping with a woman that I slept with. It's an abomination. Oh, it, shut up! It's a slut! Enough! Enough of this nonsense, young man. You dare not insult me. You are trespassing. You are crossing paths that is dangerous. Don't go that way. 
don't allow me get angry with you. It will not bode well with you. Stay clear of my relationship. Is that clear? your woman. You and I were finished a very long time ago. So don't touch me because you don't have the right to do so. But he does. My old man, he has the right. Yes, because he's my man. Now I mean it. This shouldn't repeat itself again. Come on. Stop this thing now. Okay, fine. I know I went overboard when we're together. But come on, I, I, I'm changed. All right? I, I'm, I'm back. I'm back to make things right. I don't care if you've turned from purple to white. Don't touch me. You, but seeing you again has triggered every beautiful moment. I love you. Have you lost your mind? Eh? Oh, you love me. All of a sudden, you love me again. Have you forgotten so soon how you treated me when we were together? Constantly putting me down. Now you love me. I know. I know I was wrong. Okay? I, I know that I was overly possessive and jealous. Okay? I couldn't stand another guy looking at you. So I thought that was the best way of handling it, but no, I was wrong. But I promise I'm a change man, all right? I just realized that I, I, I couldn't live without you. Then get ready to die, because I'm going to be your stepmother. You see this? It means till death do us part. No! No, it's never going to happen. You are my woman! I am not your woman! Get it out of your head! I love your father and I'm marrying him! Sorry, Shabata, don't touch me! Sorry, please, please. No, listen, son, listen. Daddy, I am not going to listen. Son, listen to, to me. I cannot listen to I, anything I, right now. I want you okay, to listen. I cannot listen to anything right now. Listen, son. I don't want you making advances on my woman. I don't want you tricking her into doing anything untoward. Are you listening? She is my girl. You listen to me? Daddy, wait. Yes. Your woman? Yes. Listen, Daddy. I will not allow you to take her away from me. Oh, really? Now, you had your chance, Darren, and you blew it. This is mine. Look, I love that lady. I just don't want you to disrespect me. I, I want to say this in a fatherly tone. Leave her alone. Respect. Dad, you, you talk about respect and, and you don't want to respect your son too. You should also respect me. That girl, Pearl, is mine. Dad, is mine. And I will not let you have it, Daddy. 
the butterfly thinks itself a bird. <laughs> Uh, well, there will never be a time the butterfly will be a bird. Never. Mr. Charles. Dad. Mr. Charles! Oh, stop. I will not stop. I will not stop. Because there's nothing you're going to tell me right now that's going to change my mind. Okay? I am not leaving Pell for you. Um, Darren. I don't remember training you to be like this, to disrespect your elders. Did I? It's only an elder that does not give out respect that gets disrespected. Hmm, Darren. Darren. I'm your father. I do not care. Right now, I do not care. All I care about is having Pell to myself. For me and for me alone. Really? So, Darren, tell me. All your education, all your exposure, just ended up in uh, being angry, disrespectful, an insolent. Was that what it was all about? Well, you called for it. You called for it the moment you went in for my woman. Darren, get out of here right now. Get out. You want me to leave? I will empty this cup of water on you now. Get out of here! Out. Okay, I'll leave. But I want you to know something. That I'm not going to allow you of it. By the way, Darren, I think this cucumber serves better purpose than you in this house. Why are you fighting your father for my friend? What's wrong with you, Darren? See, listen, I still love Pearl, okay? And she cannot be with someone like my father. What's wrong with your father? Have you suddenly developed amnesia? So you've forgotten how you treated her. You see? Guys like you are the reason she decided to try older men. Come on, listen. I, 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 I have changed. Now okay? you listen. Let my friend be happy. And stay away from her business. Come on. I, I, I Darren, stop all that. She loves your father. She's happy with your father. So you just stop being a pain in the ass. Come on, for me, for me, for me. What's all these things, man? All my life, how did how, how did I been searching for a life that's pure? Come on, that's so sure. Change. All my life, I've been searching for a love like ours. Yeah. Oh, it's a rainy day. <laughs> Darren, what's the meaning of this nonsense? I thought we understood ourselves. Why are you going out with my woman without my consent? Darren! Don't dare on me, Daddy. Don't dare on me. What's the meaning of all these things? Huh? How else do you want me to explain to you that this woman right here is mine and not yours? Stop this nonsense, Darren. Baby, baby, I'm sorry. Don't baby okay. me. Hey, I'm sorry. Okay, sorry. All right? I just want this old man, yeah, to understand that you are mine and not his. Darren, this is my fiance. Get that into your thick skull. Do you understand me? What's all these, daddy? Huh? Tell me. Why are you so comfortable being intimate with someone who that I was intimate with before, huh? Like, it baffles my mind, baby. See, baby. Yes. Oh! Are you, are you, are you, are you daft? Are you stupid? Is there something wrong with your head? 
Now beat me. Beat me. Yes. Just beat your father. Go ahead and beat your father. Are you sick? Try this once more. I will forget that you are my son. And I will deal with you accordingly. and they're doing all of this because of me. I don't want to be the reason for their fights now. Darren is just, he's getting out of hand and I hate to see them like this. I know, but for me this is different. A father and his son are fighting over me. I'm the reason for all this Toxic tension. I worry I just I just gone. It's good to fall in love. Love is not just an emotion. Love is a creative energy. It's a creative force. It wells from the inside. It energizes you. <laughs> yes, it does. Love is good. It's good to fall in love. <laughs> Yes, it's good. Ah, it's good. It's good. It's good. Indeed, love is an energetic force. Yes, Darren. As long as I breathe. As far as blood flows through my veins. I will make sure that you and Pearl do not end up together because Pearl is mine and I do not care what anyone thinks. I know you're doing all these because you're my father so you feel like you deserve it but no, I deserve her. She's mine. <sighs> you know, you're such a spoiled brat. You are so stupid. I didn't know you were this senseless. Stay out of my relationship. Did you hear me? You're standing here because of my magnanimity as a father. Because I love you. You are my son. That's why you're standing here. Love. Love? You, you love me. Mm. You love me. Mm. Like father, like son. Mm. We're chasing the same thing. But I deserve it better. Because she's mine. Mm. And I wonder. I wonder, like, what will mom think? How is she going to feel in a grave? I'm sure she's going to be crying. Enough! See, enough! The fatherly actions that you enough. are. Enough of this nonsense. Do not disrespect me or the memory of your loving mother. Don't ever do that. Now get out of my sight. You don't ask me to get up. I 
will do that. Get out this very moment. Maybe I ask you to get out of my father's house. Mm. <laughs> I want your father. <laughs> She's mine. <laughs> She's mine. <laughs> You know, when children are dancing under the rain, they are unaware of the dangers. And when the goat is dancing in front of a lion, <laughs> I'll never tell you the end of the story. <laughs> relationship once, so I think we can freely express ourselves. What we had, that's the past. And I've moved on. And somehow the person I happen to have moved on with is your father. I didn't plan it. But even if it wasn't him, I was never going to come back to you. And I'm not planning to. I just, I want you to stop what you're doing because you're hurting your father. And he's all the family that you've got. Please, just think about this. Sorry. I am sorry that I disrespected you in the way I did. I am I am deeply sorry. It was the guilt. I felt guilty about the way that I treated Pearl. And I was longing to make things right, but I am sorry. Hell, yeah. I'm sorry for everything. I'm sorry for the abuse. I'm sorry for the way I spoke to you and I treated you. I know I do not deserve you. Yes. You are a good person. Because you could have reported me to the police, the law could have taken me, and then I would have sent some 
years in jail, but you just left me. I choose you for my father. <clears throat> Tell you I'm sorry. I'm sorry for everything. I'm, I'm sorry for the, the S disrespect. Sit down, Darren. Sit down. <laughs> Daddy, I'm sorry. Sit. Daddy, please forgive me. Sit down. Sit. Daddy, please. Sit. Tell. Sit down, Darren. Sit down. Sit. <laughs> sit. Sit. Go on. Sit down. Darren. I'm fortunate you took the path you did, which hurt me badly. I forgive you. I hope you're very sincere. Is better than the other. She's unique. She's her own person. Your mom was her own person. Don't forget that. Then compare people. Get the wine. Wine. Yes. I'm getting wine. Thank you. You are. Forevermore, and I found. 